Allah is the first and most important of all the witnesses over your deeds and your actions. And it befits then that the believing men and women, they're aware of the fact that Allah Azzawajal is watching them. And this is how the righteous that lived before us were. They were constantly aware, they constantly remember the fact that Allah Subhanahu Wa Ta'ala is watching them. From the famous examples of Uthman ibn Affan radiallahu anhu, when he would remove his clothing to shower in his home to bathe, he would be lowering his head and bending his back out of shame that Allah sees him unclothed. How many people remember Allah Azzawajal at a moment like that? But the people of Taqwa never forget that Allah Azzawajal is watching. One of the early Muslims, a righteous man by the name of Hatim al-Asam. And this man, when he was young, he used to study with the teacher. And the teacher used to treat him better than the other students. One day the other students objected to this treatment that he's getting. So the Sheikh tells him, he's not like the rest of you. And to prove it, one day the teacher brings chickens. And he give, gives each one of the students a live chicken. And he tells them, go where no one can see you and slaughter this animal. And all of them went and slaughtered it, except for Hatim. He comes back and the animal is still alive. So he asked him, why didn't you slaughter it? He says, because you told me to go where no one could see me. And everywhere I went, Allah could see me. The people of Taqwa, when you tell them, go where no one can see you, they remember Allah amongst those who can see them. And most people are heedless and they don't remember Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. So Allah Azza is the first and foremost of all the witnesses. Allah is the greatest of the ones that look at us. And subhanAllah, when people want to sin against Allah Azza wa Jal, they close windows, they lock doors, they make sure there are no cameras, that no human being can walk in on them. But they care the least that Allah Azza wa Jal sees them this whole time. They care the least that Allah Azza wa Jal sees them the whole time. So that means then, it does not behoove and be fit for the believing man or woman. That when they're alone with Allah is when they're sinning against Allah. When they're in the public and with the community and in the masjid, then they show their best taqwa, their best akhlaq, their best mannerisms. And only when they're alone with Allah is when the worst evil and wickedness comes out of them. So that means then they're enemies of the shaitan in public and best friends of the shaitan in private. They're friends of Allah in public and they're enemies of Allah in private.